What's up, y'all? It's your boy Simba. Yeah, I know. I know y'all missed me. Week went by. So, uh, let's get busy with another hip hop home with your boy Simba. Now, I mean, BK sponsored all day. Some of y'all probably thinking, when are you gonna stop wearing that hoodie? Never. You're gonna see every class, baby. And if I'm not wearing it, it's gonna be on the back. Somewhere. It's gonna be somewhere, everywhere, all the time. Besides that, um, let's get down to business. I know y'all looking to move around. So, guess what today's skill of the week is? Robotics. You know, a little bit. You know, inspired by the fact of the song that we're doing. You know, that little song, The Box. Alright, so I'm going to teach you how to do some robotics. I know some of y'all probably like, man, that's so easy. I do that in my sleep. I let people like, you know what? I just, all I can do is the arm. But you know what? I'm going to teach you how to do more than that. I'm going to teach you how to go full on RoboCop. All right? So I'm going to teach you how to do robotics as a robot. And I'm just playing. That's, that's going to be a little difficult. And you're not really going to understand the concept. Okay. So when it comes to doing robotics, the first thing you always must keep in mind is muscle control, how to control your muscles. And when I say that, think of it like when you wrestling with somebody, right? You got locked fingers and you're pushing back and forth, that muscle tension, right? Your legs, your arms, you're using your, you're using your muscles, you know, your, your, your spirit to push it back, you're trying to overpower them. Or think of it like as um, you got really heavy grocery, grocery bags. Sorry, I can't speak English today. You got really heavy grocery bags, right? And you feel that tension in your arm. You're like, whoa, I'm diesel, all right? Take that concept, right? And think of that when you do robotics. So you want to think of tense muscles every time you move, okay? So right now, you can't tell, but I'm flexing, all right? And you really want to think about taking your time. So like, you know how people be like, slow motion? Add that with the tense muscles concept, you'll get it every time, all right? And you don't even have to be like super flexed. You don't, you don't, you don't be off here like this, even though it's still kind of robotic, but you want to think nice tense, you know, easy tense. So tense your muscles, flex up your muscles right now. Think, think nice swole bodybuilder, right? Relax your hands, keep the flex muscle in your like shoulders, arms. If you can, get some going in your legs. Now go real slow. Bam, stop. For effect, when you stop, shake. Make you seem real mechanic. Boom, mm, shake. Mm, shake. All right? Once you get that down, you get the slow motion movements with the tense muscles. I haven't stopped flexing my muscles yet. All right? Now, the nicer you get in this concept, the less you have to flex your muscles. Robotics just, would just come... It'll just, be, it'll just be very, you know, second nature to you. Like right now, I'm barely flexing my muscles to do the robot, but I'm pretty sure it looks so surreal to you. All right, so the more you work on it, the less you have to, the less energy you have to exert. So now that you have the flex muscles and slow movement thing, all right, now we're going to add the small details because robots do more than just back and forth like that, all right? The things that really sell the robot are things like small finger movements and small head placements, all right? Head circulation, stuff like that. That's what really sells the robot, all right? So stuff like this, boom. The smaller movements, all right? So once you get that down, remember, flex muscles, slow movements, small hands, I said that backwards. Flex muscles, small, slow movements, even smaller movements. Focus on the little things. You know, people really think, oh, I gotta move my body. Nah. You focus on your head, your hands, your your joint rotations first, the ro the rest of the stuff will be will become effortless. One of the most difficult things to teach about robotics is how to make your lower body robotic. A lot of people think, you know, you got to do that. Or you got to slide your feet like the Jackson 5, you know what I mean? Rest in peace, Michael Jackson. Um, no, it's actually simple. So the same way you're flexing up top, you want to flex down low. 
Yes, that means you must squeeze the cheeks, okay? You gotta flex them. Other than that, your robot won't be authentic, okay? You gotta, all right? So, boom. Forget the top half. The top half is human, the bottom half is robotic, all right? So, now, you wanna focus that tension into the toes as well, all right? When everything is tense and flexed, it sells it 100%. So, boom. These are my robotic legs. Alright? Now, if you saw my step, I didn't just step. I went toes first, and then I put the heel down. And what followed? My knees bent, and my, my torso went with it. That sells the robotic movement for your lower half. Alright? So, boom. Reflex down here. Alright? If I wanted to, I could <clears throat> spring and touch the ceiling, okay? So boom, reflex, step. Now you see when I step, it's not like a pick up and step, even though you can do that if you want to. If you want to get there, you can. But we're teaching the simple stuff. So boom, as my legs are, I pick them up as they are, all right? Up, toes, heel. Remember, shake for effect, all right? You wanna to go to the other side, boom, Just like that. See that? See how I'm still using that same concept, but it's that I'm just coming for coming at you forward and my steps are smaller. That way it helps, it gives less room for error. Alright? Because you know some people they're taking these big steps and then now it looks like they're gliding or they stop looking robotic. Alright? So boom. 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 Right? Remember. This is locked, okay? So when you pick that leg up, it is the same way it was when you were standing. Slightly bent, all right? Flexed into the toes. Toes first, bam. All right, nice. The toes are there first, then the heel goes down. Toes, heel. Toes, heel, all right? So you could combine those things. It looks something like this. choreography. Um, what also helps is a lot of bending of the torso and the pelvis. All right. So you bend here and you take take the bum here, right? And you push it down in there. Bam. Bop. Or you bop, bop. Reverse that. It helps. It sells. All right. So remember, tense muscles, slow movements, small movements. Tense legs. Lock joints, tense toes, toes touch the ground first when walking, all right? You mash that all together, you got robotics. Now, why did I teach y'all robotics? Remember, we doing the box. That beat kind of makes you want to be a robot in the beginning. You have to I challenge you to do your best robotics in the beginning, all right? Bam. So, Let's get to this, let's get to this choreography. Can I get to this choreography? We're gonna get to this choreography. In this choreography, your first move, freestyle. In the beginning of the song, you'll hear it. For those who don't know the song, all right? You'll hear it, uh, I freestyle that, all right? But as soon as the uh, verse starts, or would it be the chorus? Technically, it's the chorus. When the chorus starts, we're gonna start off with kicking. All right, so you're gonna go one, you're gonna kick out left. One step left, right, clap. All right, I don't really know the lyrics to so work with me here. Something, something in the box, clap. You'll, you'll see it when I actually do the choreography. All right, for after your clap, you're gonna go right hand. As you put the right hand up, you lean a little bit to the left. All right, right, same with the left, one, two. All right. Kick, one, two, clap. Right, left, one, drop. Left, right. All right, that's my left going behind my right leg, okay? So we got one, one, two, clap. Hit, 
hit, one, two, drop. All right? Kick, clap, one, one, two, one, drop. All right? From after you, after you drop, step, step. Okay? Moving on. So after, boom, boom, boom. Doom, 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 doom. Actually, now that I think about it, it is a one, two hit. So if you've just been doing the one, two, one, two hit, all right? My apologies. So one, da, da, clap, ah, 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 drop here. Well, drop, you come here as you step up and go this way, all right? From here, you're going to outline half of a box, all right? One, two, here. Bring it back this way, punch it, come back, reach into the box like this, cock it, turn it, hit, hit. All right, we'll get in, I'll get deeper into that after this, all right? So we just did one, two, one, two, drop, left, right, left, trace, trace, here, ah, punch, ah, reach, one, two, turn it. After you turn it, you go one, two, turn the feet, all right? So that's shoulder, shoulder, or chest, chest, or torso, torso, whichever one works for whoever is learning this on their own or with a group of people. So one, two, not with the hand, I'm just showing you. All right, so one, two, feet, and take your hand and what looks like a wave straight through. Now. If you can wave, or you've been working on your waving from the second hip hop home video, ah, shout out to my peoples, uh, you can wave if you want to, all right? Now, this move that looks like a wave is really just me bending and un, I, I would guess you would say unbending, I don't know. So, bending and unbending the knuckles on the back of my hand, on my hand, all right? You get it. So, you just go up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, and you just push it, you just push your hand forward, and it gives the illusion of a wave, because you see the difference now, versus, alright, it'll kind of look like a wave, but if you can wave, or you want to try to wave, or you've been learning, do it, if not, option, so, Kick, one, two, clap, ah, 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 drop, step, left, right, left, trace, one, two, turn, hit it, ah, reach in, grab the stick, cock it, turn it, chest turn, one, two, feet, hand, see how I pull back here first, two, 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 two. from here, you're going to step right, walk normally, I'm going to get Lazy. You get lazy how you want to. If you want to get lazy like this, cool. That part is up for um, your creativity to shine all over it. Okay? So, after you were here, one, two, three. Hey, what's the lyric? I don't really know the lyric. Um, I just put the sick. Oh, blow off the whole dang seal. Alright? So, blow off the whole dang seal. I'ma get lazy. Alright, from here, stand up straight. This is in the move, but I'm gonna teach it piece by piece, alright? I'ma get lazy. One, two. Alright, so it's kind of like a one, two. Like, what's good, player? Alright, so, and that's on the ball of my foot or the toes, whichever one makes you comfortable. Hand movements is up to you, just as long as you give me that one hand, open hand of two. All right? So, two. Shake, shake. Roll your dice, but you're going to show that roll, that, that rolling motion that would be the dice through your body. All right? So, it's going to be knee, right knee, left knee, pelvis, chest. All right? For our people who can wave, shake, shake, body wave, body wave. Shake, shake, roll, bop, bop, bop. For my people who cannot body wave, going up, but you can give that motion going down. 
I feel you. It's all right. Don't worry. I'm going to make that a skill of the week one for you. All right? So we up here shaking. We roll it. Right knee, left knee, pelvis, stomach, chest. Or just pelvis, chest. All right? It'll give the same effect. Okay? So we just traced. We punched it. We reached in. Cocked it, turned it, one, two with our body, feet, turn back, fake wave, step, step, get lazy however you want, one, two, chopping out the 80s, one, alright, so shake, go, one, two, bing, bop, alright, from here, you're going to look right, left, one, two, you're gonna jump on so diagonally. So, so, boom. Cash app. Alright? Just, this motion is like throwing money in the air. And the foot is just twisted. On the toes or on the ball. Alright? Cash app. Alright? So, because he says, he says it very, yeah, we're not gonna talk about that. Alright, um, <laughs> so, we're here, tossed it, right knee, left knee, pelvis, chest, right, left, so, cash app. This next part's kind of hard, I will give two options, alright, so, cash app, total wipe, alright, so for my people who got that strength in the calves, you know what I mean, got the strength in the calves, it's just a point. You don't have to hold it long. You're just here, here. For my people who can't do it but want to try, um, it's all about your balance. When you use your core while you dance, it helps your balance, all right? So if that's a move that you don't typically see yourself doing, get the finger out first. Get on the ball of the foot now while you have the support of the opposite leg. And just lean over a little bit. See how I leaned a little? Flex your core as good as you can. Everybody has a core. Don't care what you look like. You have a core. I promise you have a core. Here. And just get up there real quick. And then try to switch. Alright? You're not on your toes. You're on the ball of your foot. Alright? If you can, practice this first as well. Alright? That works. Okay? Cool. So, we're here. Hold a wipe, a brother nose. Say slap, slap. All right, that's just the left shoulder with a nice calm groove and a bounce, bounce. Bend in the knees while my shoulder goes hit, hit. All right, the hands don't really have to be like mine, just as long as you look cool. All right, so uh, we just trapped out the 80s. Boom, right, left. So. Cash app, all right. Cash app. Told a white a brother knows. That's that body weight, y'all. Come on, see. Y'all might be getting the two skills of the week already. All right. So one, two. The hands meet at the nose, and you wipe it down. Here, slap, slap. All right. Guess what? We almost done. One more move, and that's it. Cause after that. The rest is up to you. So, after we go, ooh, excuse me, after we go, slap, slap, I will never sell my soul, all right? So that's a lean forward, lean to the right, cross the hands like this, close fist. As you do this motion, the left foot comes up, all right? So, one, two, hit, all right? That's all you do with the foot, the leg, all right? Just like that, all right? So, one, two, hit to this side, lean left, right, all right? I'll never sell my soul. I can back that. After that, the phrase, and I really want to know where you at, at, it's up to you to freestyle. If you don't feel like freestyling, your boy Simba is going one, two, Oh, one, two. All right. 
I just now remembered that I did not give a second option for this movement here. All right, just to make sure I'm getting everything before we start doing the choreography full out. So, if you are a person who does not want to try this move here, or you can't do it, um, that's all I can really think of. If you got a more creative way of doing that move, by all means, do you. This choreography is for you. It is yours once you learn it. It is you. So, make it yours, alright? If you cannot do this, that is perfect. If you can't do this, that's perfectly fine. If you want to kick with it, cool, alright? If you just want to point the hand or do a little MJ, whoa, whoa, do a little disco, I mean, that's cool too. It's up to you. Just gave you like three diamond options right there. I don't care what nobody says. They would go. Yeah. Alright, so, quick run through the choreography just to make sure I got everything for you. Alright, ready? Five, six, seven, eight. Kick. One, two, Now, traditionally, 
Usually when people mess up, they would just take it out. But we're going to be realistic here. I'll be messing up in class sometimes. I'm human. So, I'm going to leave that in there with that challenge. If you could even hear me over the music. I'm sweating. So, uh, when this camera goes off, I take off all this hot stuff that I wouldn't normally dance in. <laughs> um, lab up. Stay healthy. Uh, stay indoors. Alright? Exercise up in there. Come on. Dance is definitely a part of physical fitness, y'all. Alright, helps the, the brain activity, alright, helps the emotions, alright, so um, just make sure you keep dancing guys, alright, um, much love, miss y'all, um, if you want to contact me but you don't really want to send in a video because you think it's kind of weird, hit me up on social media, Instagram if you got it, A underscore King Named underscore Simba, all right? Again, A underscore, king named underscore Simba. Not A as the at sign, regular A, a king named Simba, all right? If you want to send me any footage of you labbing, aside from like the class videos, that's cool, you know what I mean? Uh, just set a boundary. Don't message me like I'm one of your friends, even though I am an outlet and a support system for you guys, all right? I'm here. I uh, just got to set that boundary, okay? Other than that, stay fresh, stay dancing.